Riverview police need your help tonight after officers arrest a man. He is in custody, so that's not the problem. The arrest leaves the man's dog, though, without an owner. Tim Pamplin picks up the story. The pit bull, known as Black, is chained to a tree back here at this home at Jefferson and Sibley in the city of Riverview. There he is. When the police arrested his owner, he got sent to jail for several weeks. And the dog, well, is being looked after by the very same officer. Let me, let me break these up for him. Lieutenant Bemis breaks out the pup Peroni, keeping this dog fed and watered. Black isn't a really very friendly dog. Now the lieutenant approaches with the food on a shovel and slowly backs away. That was pretty calm. He says yesterday the dog was really rather aggressive. Usually he doesn't let me get that close. They're getting used to each other. Maybe he's starting to get used to me giving him food and water. He might like me a little better. So while the lieutenant and Black here are working on their relationship. A neighbor's dog has gotten loose. The neighbors aren't so thrilled. And me and my kids can't get out. My dog can't get out. The dog often escaping from its chain, keeping the family indoors. Olivia here says she just wants what's best for Black. I want this dog to get in a better home and a better situation and just not be tied to a tree outside. But whether the dog is afraid or aggressive, they simply don't feel comfortable with it being on the prowl. The dog was picked up by the owner's ex-girlfriend, but when Black bit her, she brought him right back and chained him back up to the tree, which is where he now sits. Normally our animal control would take it over to Southgate, but they're full right now, so um, every day I have to come out and feed and water. If someone's willing to uh, watch him until the owner can get him back, I don't think it'll be more than a couple weeks. Uh, give us a call and we'll work with them. Now we did reach out to the Detroit Dog Rescue Mission. They're on the case. They say hopefully by tomorrow morning, Black will have a foster home awaiting for his owner to get out the clink. That's the scene in Riverview tonight with the night camp. Tim Pamplin, local four. All right. Tim. Part of the job that I'm not Man, sure. Hadn't thought of. Yeah, but yeah exactly just, right. Yeah.